the fast food nation. Here to finally set us back on the right track is the beautiful and talented dietitian Suma with how to read labels properly and how much sodium we're getting into our diet, which apparently is way too much even for a kid. Yeah, sodium is such a big issue right now. And according to the second annual No Junk Survey by Ipsos Reid, moms feel that salt is a junk ingredient. And 80% of moms watch the amount of sodium that their toddlers are eating. And for good reason, because they're eating way too much. And I brought in three different sizes of salt because salt is a major source of sodium. Yes. And my question to you is, guess how much salt or sodium a toddler needs in a day? A quarter teaspoon, half a teaspoon, or a teaspoon? I'm going to imagine it's only a quarter teaspoon, which looks like nothing if you're looking at these right now, guys. Yeah. And you know, it's actually 1,000 milligrams, which is slightly less than half a teaspoon of okay. sodium. And, and, you, and that's for the toddler. For the toddler. And for the adult, you know, ideally 1,500 milligrams for the whole day. 1,500 for the whole day. And yet, you'll be shocked to see how quickly it adds up. I.e., if you're getting one of the teeny tiny kids' meals at a fast food restaurant, something like that cheeseburger, small order of fries, that's a child's sodium intake for, for the, the day. day. Exactly. So there's a lot of hidden sodium and hidden salt. And the idea is if you do go to the fast food outlets, you know, try to minimize the portions, get the smallest amount, have a you know, remove the cheese, get the plainest thing you can, and balance out the meal. Have some yogurt when you get home. Have some fruits and vegetables to balance out that meal. And maybe if you can, go online ahead of time so you can check out the menu mm -hmm. and see what are the healthier choices. So another thing that we need to do as consumers is read and compare food labels because that's a really important way of determining the nutritional value of a food. Okay, and we know that consumers are reading labels, but they're confused. So if you want to pick one up, and you can see what the sodium count is. For the little tummy tray, we're looking at 160 milligrams of sodium. And then for the seven grain nibbles, we've got 55 milligrams of sodium, which is pretty good. Because if you think about it, the child needs 1,000 milligrams in a day, right? So mm -hmm. 55 milligrams is pretty good. And 160 milligrams in a meal is pretty good. Anything less than 140 milligrams is considered low sodium. So these are low sodium and definitely sodium conscious. So the options are out there like this brand, Let's Grow, which is readily available. It's readily available, stores. exactly, uh, at major retailers. But you've got to read and compare the food labels because there are some products that maybe have two or three times more sodium, mm -hmm. you know, whether it's toddler food or pasta sauces or even bread okay. has sodium in it. So we really have to be savvy with label reading. So when we're, you know, leaning towards these options, it is convenient, everyone's so busy. You say make sure you fill up on Mother Nature snack food. Mother Nature's fast, fast food. foods, which are naturally sweet and naturally full of color. And you know, if you're a savvy, savvy label reader, you'll find that many foods have added sugars and added artificial colors and things like that, which is also considered junk by many moms. So look at all this fabulous color we've got here, the reds and the greens and the yellows and the blues and it's all full of antioxidants that are going to keep our kids healthy and strong mm -hmm. for a long time and adults i know the rule is if you cut it up they'll eat it up so totally, make sure it's out there totally maybe a nice little hummus dip or something it hummus goes down a little easier red, yeah exactly some red pepper dip anything thanks sue for You're i'm getting welcome. hungry now for more information <laughs> nutrition solutions.ca or let's grow.ca right now over to jen let's go not grow over to jen how's janina jen